Today on the 20 minute time frame, we have a setup. Right here, we have a slider. That's a top 4531, a decaying fractal. Okay, we broke the bottom here at 4526. All right, it broke and it turns to be down. Now, looking at our indicator here, every time we have a crossover, okay, the market top. So the indicator here is confirming the one here. Yesterday, I mentioned to go short at, uh, I believe, 45.40. We almost got that top tick, and uh, I did mention to say short. So if you're short from yesterday at 44.40, Okay, we tagged uh, 45.25. Uh, that was over the evening. So right now, what we're looking at, we're looking at a top here. Okay, that's a decaying fractal, and we have the bottom here. Uh, we broke the bottom, but that's okay, uh, as long as uh, no other fractals appear here. Okay. Now, uh, I do want to mention a similarity here. Okay, we, we do have a fractal pair. Uh, this one here is pretty close to this one here. Okay, so I would expect a turn down, provided no other uh, discovery appears in this area here. Okay, so we have to keep looking at the other time frames to find uh, a fractal that may turn the market in the other direction uh, currently we're early here we don't know what's going to happen at the open but right now uh look at the 20 minute time frame and the 10 minute time frame uh, this is a pretty bearish turn here and we have another little turn here all right and we have a fractal parrot here so the trend is pointing down uh again provided no other fractals appear here uh the other time frames we really don't have too much so we have a slider top here and a slider top here two decaying uh, fractals indicating uh the market is going to uh probably uh go down here again provided no other fractals appear in this area here so you have to keep scanning the time frames. Uh, there's nothing there. As long as nothing appears, the trend should go down. Uh, we're going to bounce around here. You can look at the five-minute time frame for maybe a clue. That's a nail. Okay, we don't really have anything here yet. So that's the, the fractal picture for today. Uh, if you're short from yesterday at 44.40, uh, all you have to do is keep uh, lowering your stop. If you want to do the trade here, okay, you can short here. This would be your stop. All right. And we'll find out what happens on the morning. Hank Wernicke, signing off.